Come on. We wanted to be able to execute CAR quite fast to go from a prototype, an idea, to engineering and production. So I managed to get into the back seat of the Saunders electric car. And what's really interesting about this single seat in the back is you feel like you've got so much space because there's nothing to the left or right of you. It's actually really spacious in here. I'm six feet tall and I've got really good headroom. My feet stretch well. I think this would be a very comfortable ride. We're not gonna have the models every year. Oh, you know, we changed the fender, we changed the hood. You know, we wanna keep this as focus more on technology and then just keep the look for as long as possible the way it is. You're just gonna order online and you will have a car delivered to your house and you'll have a manual, you're gonna have video, you're gonna have a 24 seven access to if you have any problems to our to our so-called genius bar for tech service. So uh, it's gonna be quite interesting. And that's biggest challenge what we have is like, how do, you, how do you have the least parts possible and accomplish the best product possible? And how do you put it together in least painful way? The model Saunders seems like a real contender in the electric car market. It's affordable, it's great for commuters, and it doesn't seem quirky at least from the front. But this is still the prototype. They'll be adding a few more features, such as regenerative braking, a front trunk, and a more spacious interior. Would you buy this $10,000 EV?